हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम इन द मैथ क्लास स्टूडेंट्स वी हैव स्टार्टेड विद द चैप्टर सीक्वेंस एंड सीरीज एंड वी हैव कंप्लीटेड फर्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ दिस चैप्टर दैट इज एपी अर्थमेट्रिक प्रोग्रेशन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द सेकंड टॉपिक ऑफ दिस चैप्टर दैट इज जीपी ज्योमेट्रिक प्रोग्रेशन स्टूडेंट्स you have already done the same chapter in 10th standard also so let's discuss its objectives first first to check the series for gp or not second to find the particular term using general term formula third to find the number of terms using general term formula fourth we will discuss some important question based on the above three types then fifth to find the nth term from the end then sixth to find the sum of first n terms seventh sum of some special sequences then eighth sum of infinite terms of gp ninth we will find a rational number for recurring decimals using gp then we will do the geometric mean 11th relation between geometric mean and arithmetic mean in the end we will discuss some statement sum based on gp now students we will start with the basics of gp as we all knows ap series terms are written as a a plus d a plus 2d and so on In GP series, terms are written as a, er, er square, and so on. Here, terms are in multiplication. In AP, common difference is same. In GP, common ratio is same. Now, common difference can be calculated second term minus first term or third term minus second term. In GP, common ratio can be calculated second term divided by first term. or third term divided by second term general term in ap is tn is equal to a plus n minus 1d where a is a first term n is a number of terms d is a common difference in gp general term is tn is equal to a multiply r raised to power n minus 1 here n minus 1 is in power where a is a first term r is a common ratio and n is a number of terms now let's start with the first type of gp first type is to check whether the given series is a gp or not now let's take an example series is 5 10 20 40 and so on now here first term a is 5 second term 10 third term 20 now find the r That is second by first term or third by second term. Put the values: ten upon five or twenty upon ten. After cutting, we are getting two. As common ratio is same, so it is a GP. Let's take one more example: two, four, six, twelve, and so on is a GP or not? Again, with the same pattern. Here, first term is equal to a equal to two, second term is four, third term six, and fourth term is twelve. Now find their common ratio. Second term divided by first term, or third by second, or fourth term by third term. Now put the values. We get four upon two, six upon four, twelve upon six. After cutting, we are getting three values. That is two. Here three by two and two. Here the value of R is not same in all the cases, so it is not a GP. So the necessary condition for a series to be a GP is their common ratio must be same. Let's discuss the second type of the GP to find the particular term using general term formula. Now, for example. Find the ninth term of the GP two six eighteen and so on. Here 
GP series is given. So, we can find A, we can find common ratio. So, A is equal to 2, that is the first term. Second term is 6, third term is 18. Now, R must be equal to second by first term or third by second term. Put the values, we get 6 upon 2 or 18 upon 6. After cutting, we are getting R is equal to 3. Now, we have to find ninth term. So, N is equal to 9. Tn is equal to A into R raised to power N minus 1. Put the value of N, A and R. We get T9 is 2 multiplied 3 raised to power 9 minus 1 that is equal to 8. Now on solving 3 raised to power 8 that is on multiplying 3 to the 8 times we get 6561. Finally on multiplying with 2 we will get the ninth term that is 13,000. 122. In this way, we can find any term of the GP series using general term formula if we know the value of A and R. Now students, you are able to solve the sums related to these two types of the GP. Before starting the worksheet given in SNAP homework, you must go through the links guided in the SNAP homework. Next, we will continue with the rest of the topic. Thank you.